All right, what's up, guys? Uh, Felipe with Felipe Fitness. Uh, out here, outside of Anytime Fitness, gonna try to get a workout in. Now, this is probably my third workout <coughs> since uh, getting sick with the flu about almost two weeks ago. So, um, <clears throat> we'll see how today goes. Today's leg day, although I'm probably gonna end up taking it a little light, but like I said, we'll see. Um, just based off of my other, my past two workouts, um, I, I'm still working my way back to where I was before I got sick. <clears throat> my first two workouts, my first one was a push workout, and I did have to do less than what I normally do, and yet it was, it was intense, at least it felt like it for me, just because... I get very fatigued uh, these days, obviously recovering from the flu. So, I am feeling a lot better though. H have a little bit of congestion and a little bit of cough, but it's not too bad. Uh, so, we'll see how it goes. So, I'm headed inside. They finally got one of these uh, in my gym here at uh, Anytime Fitness. This is a back extension bench. <clears throat> you probably know what this is. You probably used it yourself. If not, um, let me explain what it is really quick. So basically a back extension is an exercise that works the lower back. Um, if you use the machine, then you're just using the lower back. But if you actually use this back extension bench right here, then you're using the lower back, the glutes, and the hamstrings. Now, I feel like this works the hamstrings and the lower back equally as hard. Um, and it's a very tough on, on, <clears throat> on both of them, assuming you do it right. And so I usually like to do these uh, somewhere towards the end of my leg day or sometimes on my core day. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna, I'm actually, <coughs> <coughs> sorry, um, I'm actually gonna do these, finish up with these right now, just cause, like I said, really works the hamstrings, um, while still hitting that lower back, which I think is very important to keep that strong. So, finishing up with that and then I'm gonna go home. Alright, so I recently made a purchase off of bodybuilding.com. Uh, I <clears throat> ran out of my old protein powder, so I got some new one. And I decided to go with a flavor I've never tried before. <clears throat> so here it is. Of course, the Optimum Nutrition Gold Standard Way. Love that stuff. But I decided to try out the caramel toffee fudge. <clears throat> Now, if you remember, one of my favorite meals in the morning is our, uh, some protein pancakes. So, I decided to get this just for the pancakes uh, to see if it would make it taste any better. And, <clears throat> to be honest, it makes it taste a whole lot better. Um, I, don't, I don't make shakes anymore. I'm kind of bored with that. So, I get all my calories and protein and stuff from food and... But uh, when I do make my protein pancakes, of course I 
I use this stuff and it adds a nice caramel taste to it which I really like um, <clears throat> yeah so that's about it but I uh, also want to show you guys something so I mean look outside it's a nice day out there nothing wrong um, the problem is it is mid-December and not a single uh, drop of snow anywhere well there's some in the mountains but none down here in the valley and it's like I said it's mid-December so Christmas is like a week away which is cool but um, <clears throat> no snow so we'll see if we get any by then if not I'm not gonna worry too much about it I'm not a huge snow person myself anyway so we'll see what happens <clears throat> Yeah, anyways, I'm kind of just at home right now, chilling. Um, I'm going to eat in a little bit, and then I've got work this afternoon. Not a very busy day, so I won't be there very long. And then it's also leg day for me. <clears throat> uh, so we'll, we'll see how that goes, all right? Anyways, I will check back in with you guys in a little bit, all right? All right, what's up guys? Just checking in really quickly before <laughs> I had to work. <clears throat> so I'm actually, I'm heading to the gym right now. I'm going to do a little back stuff and then I've got work tonight, which isn't too much. And then <clears throat> after I get off of work, I have to go to the store and do a little Christmas shopping because I think Christmas is like three or four days away and still have a little bit to do there so <clears throat> that's what I have to do after work so yeah I'm gonna head over there right now so I'll check in with you guys in a little bit all right <sighs> oh, let me turn on the light my bad <laughs> all right so that's the new uh, Vasa fitness logo for what used to be Gold's Gym, but is not anymore. And actually, um, it's mid-December, and we've the gym officially changed to Vasa a month ago. Uh, that sign was put up like three days ago. Um, so, even though we've been Vasa for like a month, everybody was still thinking we were Gold's Gym, which was stupid. <laughs> Because honestly, I would think that would be the first thing you'd want to change uh, when starting a new business, but I guess not. Uh, what do I know? <clears throat> Anyways, I'm done with work, so I'm just here in the parking lot. And uh, I'm about to leave. I'm going to go to the store. Um, uh, I got some Christmas shopping to do. But um, <clears throat> just kind of want to check in a little bit, talk to you guys about... Uh, my workouts and things like that uh, as you know I've been sick these past couple weeks and I'm feeling a lot better these days but to be perfectly honest since I've been sick things have been really off for me um, with everything my with work uh, my workouts diet uh, my personal life everything just seems off and I think it's really like a mental thing just because I basically took a two-week break and now I'm jumping back into things and <laughs> it can be a little tough, uh, to be honest. My workouts don't seem as good. Well, to be honest, they do. It's just I get tired a lot quicker, so they feel a lot tougher. <clears throat> um, I'm having trouble with the diet, I guess. Uh, I'm not too bad, to be honest. <laughs> Since I got sick, I think I lost like uh, six pounds. So I'm looking a lot leaner these days, but yeah, some of that's got to be muscle. I mean, I was out of the gym for two weeks and uh, lost some of my appetite. So, I mean, it's it's inevitable. I mean, some of that's got to be a little muscle. So I'm just working as hard as I can here in the gym, but it's just a little tough. Uh, but honestly, guys, I mean, no matter what happens in your life, um, <clears throat> whether you get sick or go out of town for a while and come back and have to jump back into things uh, it's definitely gonna be hard at first but just remember your goals of what you're trying to do and the steps you need to take in order to reach those goals um, if you can do that then 
it'll be a lot easier it won't be super easy to get back on track but it will be easier and I promise you guys if uh, you work hard enough then it's just a matter of time before you reach your goals and that's something I uh, I really believe in uh, something that keeps me going especially with this YouTube stuff because it's you know it's low but it's fun so I enjoy it but anyways that's kind of my rant for the evening so I'm headed out uh, and this is kind of where the video ends so I just want to thank all of my subscribers thanks for watching uh, if you are watching this and aren't subscribed then please do so that way I can keep you guys up to date on all my videos and um, <clears throat> of course leave comments and stuff I love reading those but uh, anyways I'm out of here so I'll see you guys in my next video bye